Hi, this is Hilal. In this video on Mathematical Economic Series, we will try to solve a problem on growth equation. The question is like this. Assume that the rate of technological advance is 1.5% and both labor and capital grow at a rate of 2%. What is the output growth of growth uh, if labor's share of income is three times as high as capital share and there are constant returns to scale? The options are 1.5%, 2.0%, 3.0%, 3.5% or 5.5%. So we will see how to solve this question. Actually, the question is related to the Cobb Douglas production function. Okay, so what is our uh, Cobb Douglas production function? I will write here. We are being given the Cobb Douglas production function like this y is equal to a, which is the technological advance or total factor productivity. Uh, times k to the power alpha k is the capital and alpha is the uh, what we call the capital share in total output l to the power 1 minus alpha l is the number of labels uh, employed or number of labor hours employed and 1 minus alpha denotes the labor share in the total output okay this is our uh, standard Cobb Douglas production function okay now what the question tells us the question tells us first of all that we have a constant returns to scale okay by constant returns to scale we mean that uh, this output elasticity of capital and output elasticity of labor when we add them up it should be equal to zero that means alpha plus one minus alpha is equal to one that is meant by constant returns to scale so i uh, this simply means alpha plus 1 minus alpha is equal to 1 okay it simply means if we increase at the output sorry if we increase the input by let us say 10 percent the output will also increase by 10 percent this is the meaning of this alpha and 1 minus alpha this alpha denotes the share of capital in total output and this uh, 1 minus alpha denotes the share of labor in total output and if we add up these two uh, parameters we will get one this is meant by the constant returns to scale means doubling the input will give us the double of the output okay so let us go to the question again we are being given the rate of technological advances 1.5 the growth equation in Cobb Douglas production function I will write here first this is a given by that is del y upon y that means growth rate of output is equal to del a upon a that means the growth rate of technological advance plus alpha which is the share of capital and the total output times uh, del k upon k that is the growth rate of capital plus 1 minus alpha uh, del l upon l this 1 minus alpha is the share of capital in total output del l upon l simply means growth rate of labor now how do i uh, derive this very equation i have derived it very uh, eloquently uh, in earlier video i will uh, give you a link in the description where you will find how i have derived this very growth equation from this Cobb Douglas production function so I will not derive it again here okay so I will also provide the link in the info button now what we are being told to find we are being told to find this growth rate of output okay what is the growth rate of technological advance what we call the uh, solo uh, residual also it is 1.5 here this uh, term is 1.5 percent okay what is alpha we have to find it we are being told here that labor share of income is three times as high as capital share of income it simply means since this denotes the labor share of income this denotes sorry this denotes the capital share of income and this denotes the labor share of income so i will write here this denotes the capital share this denotes the labor share okay what is the relationship between capital and labor uh, here we are being told that 
के एंड एल दैट लेबर शेयर ऑफ इनकम इज थ्री टाइम्स एज हाई एज कैपिटल शेयर ऑफ इनकम लेट अस से वी हैव कैपिटल शेयर ऑफ इनकम एज एक्स ओके देन व्हाट विल बी द लेबर शेयर ऑफ इनकम इट शेज इट इज थ्री टाइम्स एज हाई हेज एज हाई एज कैपिटल इफ कैपिटल शेयर इज एक्स देन लेबर शेयर विल बी सिंपली थ्री एक्स ओके एंड दियर समेशन विल बी इक्वल टू वन why because we have the constant returns to scale so you have to uh, uh, understand it properly what the question says question says that labor share of income is three times as high as capital share of income i have denoted capital share of income by x then what will be the labor share of income it will be three times the capital share of income that means 3x and their addition will be equal to 1 because we have the constant returns to scale okay so if we add them this will become 4x x plus 3x is equal to 4x should be equal to 1 or x is equal to 1 upon 4 okay now what is this x x is the capital share of income it comes out to be 1 by 4 so our capital share of income is equal to uh, this thing and what is labor share of income labor share of income will be simply equal to if this these two add up to 1 and x is equal to 1 by 4 then if we use this relation very relationship then we have uh, in place of x we i have 1 upon 4 plus 3x should be equal to 1 or we have 3x is equal to 1 minus 1 upon 4 if we transpose this or 3x is equal to if we subtract uh, 4 minus 1 is 3 upon sorry this comes uh, uh, 4 minus 1 is 3 4 minus 1 is 3 so i will write here 3 upon 4 okay am i doing the uh, 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 correctly the things here no i am not doing it correctly here so let me rub this out so since our x comes out to be 1 upon 1 upon 4 what is labor labor is equal to 3 times the capital share then means that this means then our capital share or labor share will be equal to 3 times x which comes out to be 3 into 1 upon 4 which comes out to be 3 by 4 okay now what is this this is our labor share this is our labor share and what is our labor share labor share is 1 minus alpha okay this is capital share and what is capital share here it is alpha so i will write it here alpha okay now we just need to plug the values here that means we got the technological advances was 1.5% uh, plus alpha we got here alpha equal to 1 upon 4 and what was the growth rate of the capital uh, growth rate of capital and labor was same it was 2% so i will write here 2% in place of this okay because it is the capital uh, growth so i will write here 2% a uh, plus 1 minus alpha which we calculated it comes out to be 3 upon 4 and what is labor share sorry uh, percentage change in the labor which is given us labor grows at 2% so i will write here 2% okay so this will come out to be we have 1.5% here we will get a uh, 1 upon 2% this is 0.5% so i will write here 0.5% Uh, plus here we will get 3 upon 2 3 upon 2 percent means 1.5 percent so here it is also 1.5 percent okay so which comes out to be 1.5 percent 1.5 percent is 3.5 percent plus 0.5 percent comes out to be uh, sorry it is 3 3% plus 0.5% it comes out to be 3.5% okay that means the output growth in this very scenario will be that is del y upon y this denotes the output growth 
it will be equal to 3.5%. I hope I make myself clear in this video. So I will repeat how did I calculate it. We were given and uh, the change in the technological advance is 1.5%. Uh, labor and capital grows at a rate of 2%. Also, the labor share of income was three times as high as capital share of income. And we were told to find the uh, growth rate of output if we have constant returns to scale okay so by constant returns to scale we mean that the labor share of income so, or uh, sorry the capital share of income and labor share of income should be equal to one that means alpha plus one minus alpha should be equal to one that means the exponents should add up to the one okay capital share is alpha and labor share is one minus alpha and the relationship between them is that uh, labor share is labor share is three times greater than the capital share if capital share is three then labor share will be 3x and their addition should be equal to one okay so if we solve this we got x is equal to one upon four that was our alpha and three upon four which was our one minus alpha and we just used this very uh, growth equation which i have uh, and there i would earlier in a video i will give you the link of that very video also we just need to use this very uh, growth equation uh, to get the uh, required result okay i hope i make myself clear in this video please share subscribe it if you feel that i am making myself useful for you people thank you